Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And in this video, we're gonna see wrapping or printing with the wrapper tool. And if many people don't know about the wrapper tool and what the ex actually wrapper is, wrapper is a Python script that takes the guesswork of a fingerprinting of website firewall on your hand. It is an active fingerprinter that actually connects the web server, but it starts with normal HTTP request and accelerate the necessary. You can see the interaction on installing WebProof in your Linux machine because it is not compatible with your Windows or Mac OS and it's pre, and it's pre installed in your Linux or, or any penetration distros. So let's start the some tutorial of WebProof web fingerprinting with WebProof. So I will type WebProof here and start our tutorial webproof and I will give the a new website name and just remember you can give uh, any website name but please make sure it is only for education purpose don't do it for exploiting any website so it's checking The result is here. It's saying it's behind the cloudflare. This website is behind the cloudflare. Okay. The number of requests sent is one. Okay. Now let's check the help or type wafu hyphen hyphen help. And as you can see here, all the option for help, you can choose anyone and here is saying you can choose more than one URL plus you can attack the multiple website. So we will do later. And B hyphen B for borders attack, hyphen A find A okay l hyphen l of the list okay just check the help menu if you feel any difficulty in using webflow tool so i will give you a hyphen p It's again giving the same result. This website is behind the cloud thread, and the number of requests sent is one. Okay. Now. If you want you can do uh, you can if you want you can uh, use the other users and try scanning with try scanning so I will choose another website let's see what result will come it's checking Generic, generic detection result. is using generic detection result and the number of percent is 13 okay no web is found and here without and here above is saying it's behind the cloud okay. and let me tell you guys uh, we have we can also use another detection method for tool like hyphen a hyphen l like you can use you can see the option or you can go directly go to help menu to see all of them 
don't stick with one and one on one more thing this tool it just remember that this tool provides this tool might provide a false result or uh, the result which provided by tools not sh not sure please do it do it fingerprinting manually if you can and it's just for like if you want if you want you can do it manually uh, it's better to do that and i tell you don't don't fully trust on this kind of this type of tools sometimes they might give wrong result so that's it if you like the video don't forget to like and subscribe and peace